Good morning, good morning and welcome. It's Jelly Cube from the Sunshine Coast in Queensland, Australia. Coming to you with a little, um, basically a rainbow pour, something bright and uplifting on this black canvas that I have here. So I don't think I've ever bought the canvas before that's already come with a, a black base to start with. I, I don't think I have. Um, but it'd be interesting because I'm not going to let the paint run all over this particular um, canvas. I'm going to just pour some bright colours in areas over it. I have just finished doing a really bright and uplifting pour over a ceramic dog for the new baby that's coming. So I have a bit of paint left in the cup of really bright colours and I'm going to add to those colours and then pour over this black canvas and see what I get. I used really bright and uplifting colours previously so I'm going to just add. What I'm adding is the Montmartre pre-made pouring paint so you don't have to do anything to them whatsoever. Um, just, just pour. So that is exactly what I'm going to do. So the supplier I get these from in Australia is in the drop down box. If you're in the US or um, UK, I believe they're all available on Amazon. So um, yeah, it should be available for everybody. So I'm only gonna add a little bit more color to this because it was loaded up with color. So that was the bright yellow and that's the Shiraz. So I'm actually going to, should I or should I not? I'm just thinking, do I do the figure eight or I just do a little traveling rings? Maybe I just do little traveling rings and see how I go. It's kind of a traveling ring pour. Come back over it again. Uh, just something a little different and see how it turns out. If it's not to my liking then I'll, I'll look at other ways that I can maybe improve it and ultimately if you you know you don't feel you're happy with it at all then you just scrape it. It is a waste of paint but it's better that you be happy with something I think that's just about it. Okay, I did have a bit of blue in the bottom, which I think would be nice if I can. Uh, no, just too much. So, might oh, I was going to blow some of these bits out, but I think I will just gently tilt. Maybe I'll just keep it to this one side of the canvas for this particular colours and then I'll work out. I've already got an idea what I can do for the top bit. So it's just nice and gently just tilting it. So these pre-made pouring paints, you know, they're a no-brainer. You don't have to think about what to do or you know making up your pouring medium even though that's quite enjoyable I don't mind making up the pouring medium and the paints that's quite therapeutic in itself but um, you know this pre-made pouring paints how easy is this you just if you feel like painting you just get out there and start doing the different techniques they basically do every technique They'll do a Dutch pour if you uh, just water them down a bit. 
they do flip cups, they do swipes, they do balloon kissing, so pretty good, pretty good. So these are quite thicker as you can tell, they're taking quite a, a time to move, but that's fine, just relax about it and let it all happen. And I haven't got gloves on, what has to go there? And did I even thank you for joining me and uh, thank you so much for watching my um, content on my channel. I'm on, I think I'm on 85,000 now or close to it. Um, and my next personal goal, just to show my kids, my grown up children should I say, they're not kids, that even a nana can have a go and get the YouTube's uh, I don't know what you call them, that plattery thing, the gold, the silvery, I don't know what it's called, the play button or something. <laughs> I don't even know what it's called, but I'd like to get it uh, just to show my children and my grandchildren. I've got a 16 year old granddaughter that, you know, Nana can do this as well. It's not all about the young people. It's a, or for all ages. So there you go. So, oh, 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 little idea now what do I want to do? I want to keep that pretty much there. I'm going to just, oh, coming out a bit quick there. Just pouring some along the top there. There's that nice pink Shiraz. You know how I like my bright colours and I do really like the bright colours. I do like doing the classic, classic kind of uh, neutral looks too but I really do prefer the bright colours. As you could see. Righty ho. Now, I'm not sure whether I'd use my straw or my little air blower. Let me try with the straw first. Oh, hokey deck. And of course, it wouldn't be a jilly pour if it didn't have some balloon magic happening. So this is just the small balloon that it's just an ordinary balloon. And I just put it over the tap and put a bit of water in to weight it down. Now, other people have asked me, do you, you do you fill your bigger, bigger balloons that you balloon kiss with water? And the answer is no, I don't, because I've had a complete disaster where it's it's just let go and gone all over the place, so no, I don't. So I'm going to press these in here and maybe press them in. I'll do a few up on the black, which look quite sweet. liking it it's just something a bit different for me we all like to try different I like it I think I should leave it with that negative space at the top because as you know I'm not very good at leaving negative space and I've got a bit of black there negative space so I will leave it. Pretty sweet. Sweet little painting that. It's just arrived in the car. Turn it around so you can have a look at. But please, 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 please have a look at the end photos where I'll put 
where it's nice and dry. So there you go. It's kind of a traveling ring stretched out. Just some little sweetness added here. I think that's quite cute. What do you guys think? It's just something a little different. Black canvas. Ooh, I like it. I like it. <laughs> Crazy lady she is. There you go. Sort of looks like an abstract spring garden. Thank you so much for joining me. Thanks for putting up with my crazy antics uh, in my art room while I'm enjoying myself. So until tomorrow, where there will be an absolute definite another pour for you to take a little um, sticky beak at. So until tomorrow, bye for now. Please take care.